Catching photos showing a roaring brush fire that broke out near Hurricane on State Road 9. The flames came right up to the road. This was caught on camera by a resident there. It's just the latest fire to pop up, and as you tons know, we can expect more of this throughout the summer. City leaders are trying to prevent fires, especially those caused by people. So one of the things they're eyeing? Fireworks. New specialist Debbie Worthen is looking into efforts from fire departments to make sure people are aware of what's at risk. Debbie, you also talked to a man tonight whose house almost burned down from a firework. Yeah, that's right, Dini. In, in September, it will be five years ago that a hillside here in Harriman went up in flames. It destroyed one home and it almost burned Richard Loy's home to the ground as well. That fire spread so fast and surprisingly, it was not caused by a firework like an aerial, but a smoke bomb. It was horrible. September 15th, 2018 is a day Richard Loy will never forget. But we left the house thinking that morning it was going to be a bad fire day. And of course, our house almost burned down. He came home to firefighters surrounding his house. Up where my mailbox is, it came down mostly on this side. Fire crews worked fast to save his home. They couldn't save the one just up the hill. Ryan Love remembers it well, too. Any firework can be dangerous, and a lot of people have a misconception that, you know, sparklers and smoke bombs are, are not dangerous. No fireworks are legal in September, even smoke bombs, when those kids lighting them in the hills of Harriman cause this. Starting Saturday, you can purchase fireworks in Utah. You have just eight days in July where you can legally light any of them, July 2nd to the 5th, and again, July 22nd through the 25th. Although fire crews would really rather you just leave it to the pros. I think the safest thing people can do during these next holidays coming up is actually um, go and enjoy a professional fireworks show. After Loy's experience five years ago, he and his wife will sit these holidays out and make sure their home and the hills nearby stay quiet. We don't really like fireworks at all anymore. Well, in addition to the calendar day fireworks restrictions, there are also only certain places you can and cannot light them. So for more information in Salt Lake County, you can go to unifiedfire.org or check with your specific city to see where they're legal. Back to you. Boy, we're entering a season. I hope lots of people are just going to be so careful. Debbie, yeah. thanks.